Did you know that JotForm offers analytics on every single one of your forms to view analytics, statistics, and more? Well, let me show you how. Hey, JotFormers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly, and as you can see, I'm currently in the desktop version of my dashboard. And like I mentioned, if you love data and want more information about your forms, JotForm offers a built-in analytics solution in every single form. So let me show you how to access all of that really rich data. So I am going to go ahead and utilize my second form here, my thank you samples. I'm gonna hover over the more option on the right. Then under data, we're gonna come down to form analytics. Now, as you can see at a glance, you have access to a lot of data. Now, across the top, we can see that we landed in the This Month tab, but if you would like to see it just this week, we can choose that, we can choose all time, or we can even choose a custom date range and add in our dates right over here to the right. Now, going down just a little bit, each one of these boxes as well are hyperlinks. You can click on any of these. As of right now, you can see we're currently in our views. We can jump over and we can take a look at our responses, our conversion rate, as well as the average amount of time someone spent on our form. Now, if we scroll down, we get to see even more information. Now, you can see we're currently on the traffic tab, and this is going to let us know all of the recent visitors to our form. This gives me the name of the person who filled out the form. The next column is going to be the date or how many days ago they filled it out. We have if we received a response, we have the duration they spent on the form, their location, and what device they use. Were they on a computer? Were they on a mobile device? And we can also jump to the next tab and look at that device. We can see if they were on a smartphone, if they were on an iPhone, the desktop Samsung, we get to see what that looks like. And again, that average time. If we jump over to platform, we can see if they were on Chrome, if they were on Safari, Firefox, again, that average time and the platform. And if we head over to location, we get to see where in the world the people who are filling out your form are located. Now, the great thing about this too is once you're done looking at this data, you can actually scroll back up to the top and we can choose a different form to view straight from here, no going back to our dashboard. And it really is as simple as that. If you have any questions about how to view form analytics and all that data for every single one of your forms, let us know down below in the comments. If you like this video and you got some value, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notification every time we put out a new video. I'll see you next time.